Hey YouTube, welcome back. Uh, today I'm going to show you guys the, the tutorial on how to uh, install the app and then uh, set this uh, DJI Osmo uh, mobile to uh, work. So first of all, let's go ahead and then uh, you need to uh, download the app. Okay. Let me turn on the brightness higher, brighter. Okay. Let's see. So you need to go to either your uh, iOS, I mean, uh, App Store or the Play Store. This is the uh, Samsung Luna Pro, uh, J3 Luna Pro, uh, Luna Pro. Okay. So make sure you go to download. Uh, DJ Go or DJI Go. And there's the app right there. And just click on install. But make sure you keep your uh, DJI um, Osmo Mobile off. So let me uh, take this out real quick. Uh, it's kind of slow because I'm uploading the video at the same time, so just uh, wait. Anyway, before we uh, go ahead and proceed, I want to show you guys uh, what you need to adjust. Uh, this knob right here is just to adjust the, the smartphone holder right here to open Y or to make it tighter. So if you uh, turn it clockwise, it's going, it's getting smaller. As you can see, the gap. And counterclockwise to loosen up or make it bigger. All right. And then uh, another knob is uh, this one. This one is for the to adjust your uh, arm. So uh, in order for your uh, gimbal to be balanced uh, correctly, you need to put in your phone first and then uh, adjust uh, to make sure it's balanced, okay? So let's go ahead and, and then this is your uh, smartphone sensor right there. It will sense it. If you, if you don't put your phone there, it's not going to work, okay? So that's a sensor right there. So make sure you guys don't uh, break that or crack it. So when you, at first when you, uh, I opened this uh, gimbal, it was a little bit wider like that, okay? Wow, you can't really adjust too much or what? Let's see. Oh my God. <laughs> So I'm not sure the, if you have a bigger phone, you're not going to balance correctly or what's going on. And because uh, you don't, it will not allow you to adjust too much. So what? Uh, 
So that's the farthest uh, it will go out. So hopefully uh, when you have a big bone, it's going to balance correctly. So, uh, with this phone, I push in all the way already, but somehow it's still not balanced uh, correctly. So let's, let's see about that. So that's the instruction on how to adjust your to get it balanced uh, correctly. So when you put this one in, make sure your camera is not covering by the arms or anything like that. So for me, it only uh, fit one way, so I got to put it this way. And make sure your uh, smartphone on the bottom is uh, pushing against that rubber. You see the there's a groove right there or the notch. Make sure you push in right there and just uh, turn on this uh, knob right here to make it tight. And don't over tight it too, uh, too much. Okay, and you're supposed to uh, put it level. So make sure it's uh, balanced like this. That's what it says, okay? And before you do that, you want to go ahead and then uh, turn on your Bluetooth on your smartphone. I don't think it's finished uh, downloading, the, it's still downloading. So let's go ahead and then uh, go to the Bluetooth. So you drop down the menu. And uh, just the Bluetooth is on, but you want to go to the setting. Uh, well, yeah, we've got to wait until I finish install the app first. Because uh, if you turn it on right now, the gimbal is not on, so it's still. So as you can see, it you can just uh, toggle on and off on, on over here. But we want to sync it with your uh, gimbal, the DJI gimbal. So let's go ahead and uh, see if it has installed already. So it's only about 26% because um, I'm uploading the video, so. So I'm just gonna let it uh, download and then uh, we'll be back. All right, guys, uh, I finally got finished installing. So let's go ahead and then uh, open this app. Uh, I turned on the Bluetooth already, so let's see, open. So this is uh, DJI Go, Go Create. unzip resource file so you gotta agree let's place a uh, agree so i guess you gotta sign into the account or sign up So let me sign up and I'll be back. Jesus, so many steps. So I just click on sign up. And I gotta set up the password. Hold on just a second. So you gotta set up the new password and then uh, by clicking on the next, uh, you agree to the term and condition. Hit done or next. I'm not sure what's going on here. Oh, there you go. Let 
We click on next. Ah, male, female, unspecify. Complete. It says connect your device. You guys select uh, what kind of device you have. Oh my God, this is the wrong one that I download. You gotta keep be killing, killing me. Let me see. Oh, there you go. So apparently you got so many uh, devices. Uh, so you gotta swipe to your left. And uh, this is the Osmo 2. Mobile 2. There's so many different uh, kind right here. So connect your device. Oh, forgot to turn it on, guys. Sorry about that. Oh my gosh. So let's go ahead and then uh, turn on this uh, DJI. That's your status light. So I press connect. So it's detected already and then you gotta press uh, connect again. And after you connect, it will give you this uh, screen, ready or exit. So you click on ready. There you go. Uh, it says uh, hold the Osmo mobile upright before we go ahead. And then I press continue. Point the Osmo mobile left and right or up and down. Left. Osmo will translate this movement smooth. Up and down. Press next. Slide the stick left and right or up and down. Left and right. Up and down. So as you can see right now, so I'm using my joystick right now to go to rotate my screen. Pretty cool. All right. And then uh, I could toggle left or right. I pretty double tap for the front facing camera. Oh no, go back to his original position. I think the triple, if you uh, tap it three times. Right here. One, two, three. There you go. So this is your front facing camera. Tap it three times again to go back. Oh, I tap it twice, sorry. So, one, two, three. So yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm gonna play with it and record for you guys to check it out. Of course, I'm not gonna use this camera. This camera is not good. Uh, well, maybe I'll test it out and see, you know. It seems uh, pretty stable. So there is your uh, camera button right there. And if you s slide down, that is your video, okay? And then you can select whatever uh, setting, change the setting over here. There's uh, auto time lapse, 
hyperlapse and then end time lapse so let's go ahead then uh, you could also click on record button right here I forgot to mention this is the shutter to snap a picture shutter button uh, let's see so for example I want to take a picture of it you just snap it right there so you take a picture already okay so let's go to video so this is to record your video so as you can see you hear the beep and it start recording right now so you can maneuver back and forth so it doesn't shake that much So you press again to stop and then on the right hand side there's like a settings there's a camera gimbal general or live you could do live stream so you can upload to your Facebook your YouTube your Weibo or custom let's go back oh shoot general so you can name the device, device name. You can change it or whatever, but I'm not gonna change it right now. So let's see, refresh, fresh guy or about gimbal. So right here you could do like a fast configuration, slow or fast. I mean medium. So you could calibr you could do the stock calibrating uh, calibration for uh, horizontal or uh, auto calibration, joystick control direction, and then uh, pan reverse or tail reverse. Uh, you could reset the gimbal, and then the camera track level. You can put on high, right now it's on middle or low. Panorama quality is on low. You can set it to middle or high. And then you can reset the camera or save on stitch panel uh, photos. So. so let's see what's this button right here. That is, that is the gimbal. Uh, Right now it says uh, C mode, pitch is not locked, phone detection is on. So C mode right now is walk or you could change to uh, sports, maybe like when you're running or something. And then video, you could over here you could set like a different resolution, grid, Flash, white balance, uh, beauty, beautiful, beauty mode, uh, beautify mode is off right now. But if you want, you could turn it on. Okay. So I said resolution will will uh, be changed. Beauty fi is only available uh, when shooting video in seven twenty resolution. Because this one, uh, the phone is not 1080p, so turn it off for now. All right, so this is uh, how you set up this uh, app with your uh, DJI Osmo Mobile Gimbal. All right, hopefully you guys uh, give a thumbs up. And then uh, like this video, please uh, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And uh, share this with your friend and family on social media. And be sure to turn on that bell for notification. Alright. Anyway, thank you for watching. And happy Friday. And I'm out. Peace.